Hello, I'm Lucy and welcome to or welcome back to my channel for a very short but new Disneyland Paris vlog series. <music> Like our last visit, we're staying at Hotel Dream Castle, which is a Disney partner hotel and is about a five, 10 minute bus journey away. Our second room that we've been given, I'll tell you more about that in a minute, uh, is exactly like the room we stayed in last time. So if you want to see a full room tour, then go and check out that vlog and I'll leave a link in the comments below or the description. Our journey began yesterday evening by getting the Elizabeth Lion train into Heathrow Terminal 5. We did have to switch trains twice um but there was lots of stuff around at paddington station and the other stations actually so if you do get a little bit lost or confused then there's always someone around to help you tell you when the next train is etc but it was actually very easy to use we only have cabin bags so we went straight to security which was very quick and efficient and then we headed straight for weatherspoons and our food was really delicious and it came out really quick our flight was at 8.30pm and it was a little bit delayed so we didn't end up getting to Charles de Gaulle Airport in Paris until 11pm. We followed all the signs for the ride app pickup area and got our Uber from there to the hotel and that cost 59 euros. We arrived at the hotel, it was very quiet, very beautiful as you can see here and we were given our keys to our room and this is unfortunately what we found. Oh, <laughs> um, sorry, what? <laughs> uh, I don't think they finished <laughs> making the room up. <laughs> In the bathroom, the bug brush is on the side. <laughs> That's out of the sink. That's not in the holder. The bog thing is up there. The shower thing has been taken off of the shower. It's like it's been torn apart and, and there's nothing in there over there. What the? Hmm. We obviously went back down to reception and showed them the photos of what we were greeted with and they were very embarrassed but they were also very nice and dealt with it really well they gave us a new room straight away and the manager came over and spoke to us and he could not apologize enough he said if there's anything wrong with this room come and tell me straight away don't even come down just call just call reception and i'll come straight up but we didn't need to as this room is perfect since our last visit to disneyland paris which was last month there are a few new things around the park um, the season is now called Symphony of Colours and there's a few new decorations um, in Main Street USA and also a new show slash parade called Million Splashes of Colour. This is supposed to be like the Dream and Shine Brighter Parade which was to celebrate the 30th anniversary. I've seen a few clips on TikTok and YouTube and I really like the main song of the actual parade but when it gets to the show at Central Plaza where they get on the stages in the middle. I'm not quite sure about that. However, obviously I need to see it in person myself. So I'll form my own opinion then and I will film it and let you know. So right now it is quarter to eight in the morning and we are about to go and do something very special. We're going for a character breakfast at Plaza Gardens. Um, This was a very last minute booking and our booking is for quarter past eight. So because it's actually before even Magic Hours opens, you get to be like the first people in the park, basically. And this is a great opportunity to get there a bit earlier, take some photos without anyone in there. So that is going to be really exciting. So let's not waste any more time with me talking and come with us. So the time is currently 8.05. I don't know why I walk and talk because the camera work is terrible. But the queues for the security are really short. Oh my god, it's really windy. But there's, I just realised there's walls going into, I'll show you. Hmm. No queues. Doggy. Okay. The 
this is the first time seeing all the symphony of colour decorations. Is that what it's called? Symphony of colour? Something of colour. I think that screen is supposed to change character every now and then. <clears throat> I've seen a few clips on YouTube and stuff of these new decorations, but I think the decorations are supposed to be um, winter turning into spring and that's why they're all like got ice over them and the floor's supposed to look obviously snowy icicles up on the bandstand oh it looks so nice doesn't it with no people around <laughs> <laughs> so we're here at the character breakfast. Adults usually cost 50 euros. It, last time we came it was 35, so they put up a fair chunk, but because we've got the annual pass, um, it came to 42.50. And um, we're sitting on nice little And I will show you the characters in a moment. The food is actually the same as it was last time, so I'm gonna put in that clip from before now. That was a really cute breakfast. I'll leave some pictures in there because I didn't video too much. Um, but we're now going to go on Space Mountain because it's only 10 minutes. Hopefully we won't regret doing this after breakfast. But last time, uh, you'd have seen in my last vlog that on Flight Force, I had a bit of a problem with my glasses. So I bought myself a glasses strap. This is gonna be the first time I try it out. So I'll let you know how I get on with that. And you might see me with different glasses after this ride. <laughs> Hopefully not. <laughs> Face man and done. My glasses strap works because my glasses are still the same ones. Stop. We're now going on Autopia and we've not been on this since, well, I was about 10 and you were probably about 7. That's probably the last time we came on this when we were like 10 and 7. <laughs> Get. <laughs> <Whee>! <laughs> I don't trust my he's driving on the real road. <laughs> 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 can, can you be trusting on this? What do you expect to do like that? Oh, I'm joking. <laughs> Whee! Oh, no. Over the bridge. Whee! Traffic jam. Oh, no. Ah! This oh, goes no. up. <laughs> <laughs> oh. This goes on for a 
lot further than I thought. <laughs> oh, this is so cute. Oh, Oi! oh. <laughs> crash. <laughs> yeah, you're doing well. Yeah, he's oh, 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 slow down. <laughs> oh, chin, he's nearly got hit by a pigeon. <laughs> Tokyo's on now. We're making our way through Fantasyland, hoping to catch um, Piglet and Rabbit um, at the back of Casey Jr. ride. And sometimes that's where you can meet them. And we've never met Piglet and Rabbit before, so that'll be quite nice to do. And then we're going to head to Pirates because that looks like it's still five minute queue. So these Christmas stalls are still here that we got our delicious treats from um, in January. But I don't know how long these are going to be here till. Uh, I guess I'll keep you updated each time we go. So the entrance to Casey Jr. is just there, but where these green umbrellas are, I think that might be where Piglet and Rabbit will be. Um, I shall let you know if we find out. I just asked the cast member in the um, yellow jacket if that is where Rabbit and Piglet are meeting. He said uh, it's not what he's into, it could be different characters. Um, it's just a random time of the day, but it's usually early afternoon. So we're we coming. Gonna come back early afternoon. Got yeah, we got to. No queue at all. Right, Matthew, where are we off to now? Pirates. <laughs> While we're walking there, just to let you know, this place here, um, the old mill, is the best place to get the mini pancakes with Nutella or ice and sugar. They're amazing. Top tip when it splits off, always go to the left because it's so much quicker. Don't know why. Oh no, I do know why. Because the Premier Access people get to go in the queue that joins the right hand side. Quickly run over to Central Plaza. It's very sunny. Mm. Hopefully the, the rain will actually go in at uh, the rain. The sun will go in while the parade's on, but we're just waiting for a symphony. No, what's it called? Million splashes of colour. I'll get it right one day.
say one. <laughs> okay, I didn't use that word. I said a little bit underwhelming. I told you in a minute. These are the pins that are in the shop by Big Thunder Mountain. The other side. My apples on. The shop's opposite Lucky Nugget, and we bought our straight jerseys here. Loads of clothes in here. <laughs> Phantom Manor star. <laughs> I think around here they've got sweets. There's so much in here. Nice little bits as well to take home. Right opposite the shooting gallery. What? The sun's really come out. Right, we were talking about that show. Um, I think we're going to have to see it again because we wasn't standing in the best position, as you can see. Um, I think we'll try and stand in the inner bit next time, as that's where you can see everything. Also, the sound wasn't that good. Like it didn't feel like you was immersed, did it? Like it doesn't didn't feel like you was, was on the on the floats. Oh, was it? I think so. Yeah. Oh. It just didn't feel like he was properly like involved, um, so you couldn't really get that into it. But yeah, I think we're gonna have to see it again to get a proper good feel for it. But we're now gonna go on the riverboat landing for the first ever time. Really. <laughs> I didn't just drop my phone. And these are the shops that where you just went in. They're all actually linked. You can go through all of them. That was something that we've never done before. It took a little bit of time, it wasn't that much to see, as you can see. But we're now going to go and get some food and try Casa de Coco, I think it's called, which is the first time that we've been there. That's a nice little touch, he um, gave us each a menu as we were walking around in the queue. I think we're going to go for a kids meal. Are you allowed to, are you allowed to frozen margarita with a kids meal, do you reckon? <laughs> mm. How much did this come to? 24 years. $24.90 but that's with our uh, discount as well we've both got the chicken things they didn't come with fries so you have to pay for them separately that food was delicious um, but my battery's about to die I've got 25% so I'm going to put my phone in my bag 
and maybe see you. Well, I don't know when I'll see you next. <laughs> It's about, well it's one o'clock in Fantasyland, they've got a few character meets going on at the moment. You've got Goofy there, um, Pinocchio and Chippito there, and we just met Pluto as you'd have seen, and also right by the teacup they've got Tweedledum and Tweedledee, which we're going to go and try and meet now. There's also Tigger and Eeyore over there, so you don't need to spend your 50 euros, you can just queue up, <laughs> basically, because all the characters that we met this morning almost all of them are out there was um alice and uh, the mad hatter were over there somewhere but we're just going to join this queue for tweedledum and tweedledee there's a lot of character meets going on so around lunchtime ish keep your eyes peeled in they're peeled in fantasy land Right next to the old mill, or the mill, old mill, whatever it's called. That was such a fun meet. I'll put a video <laughs> in now that we're being portrait made. <laughs> Lovely, thank you. <laughs> Bye. Hello. Um, but that was by the one of the best interaction we've had. It is so funny. If you get to see them, um, it, it does take a little bit of time because they make a lot of interact, uh, a lot of effort with the interactions. But that was 100 percent worth the wait. Looking at some more pins. I think we've seen most of these before, I think. Yeah. Oh, it's a small world. The pins don't have their own individual prices on them. What they do is like a colour system. Um, so you can see on the back of this one it's yellow. It should be 11 euros. This looks so cosy. That feels so nice. I sell autograph books in here, pens, light up things. It's kind of a big hoodie. Is got some really nice uh, small world bits as well. Carousel. This building here is the shop and you've got the entrance to the right there or just right tucked around the corner there is an entrance oh and also one just there where that person is. The roads are very busy at the moment so we're just trying to get in some characters and shops and I'm still going to take you along for everything that we do. I'm hoping it's a better view. We're right in the middle. Cool. Central Plaza. Yeah, right. 
c'est là, là le rap, le la variété aussi. C'est bizarre. Qui a les Avez-vous déjà parlé aux étoiles J'adorerais connaître vos histoires. Cette musique incroyable doit être le vœu de quelqu'un. without a float in your way and for the music to be surrounding you um or definitely to say to stand in that middle bit and not where we stood the first time so these are our new opinions but obviously it was our opinion at the time of what we saw so we're just headed back to the hotel now to um have a nap and just freshen up a little bit but we're gonna stop in Disney village on the way through if we buy anything or show anything good then I shall show you. Okay, I love the whole section colour. Spirit jersey, down the back. This is also really cute. Oh! They've got loads of ears in here as well. We're gonna get an Uber back to the hotel. Um, if you saw my last vlog, you'd have seen that the bus situation's a bit hectic for our hotel because it the bus um, goes to five different hotels, so it's a lot of people, and the bus only comes once every 20 minutes, so it can get a little bit crazy. Um, the Uber is 10, probably 10 euros each way, um, and me and my brother just split it between us. So, okay, so had a nap been in here for quite a while because it's now 10 to 7 but we're about to head out back to the park as you can see it's now raining so i don't know how much i'll be able to film because i'll probably be like this most of the time <laughs> but we'll see how it goes i'll film what i can and i'll check in with you soon Decorations at night time. They look nicely up. Pretty. Just coming around for some food. Bella not a but look at all the twinkling lights in the trees. Looks so pretty. I think we're gonna go in the small world after. Yay! I don't know how much you can see, but I've got Neapolitan pasta and Minute Maid and some garlic bread somewhere there. And Matthew's got Mickey Show pizza and garlic bread. That was a really nice dinner. Um, not the yeah, pasta before, but that actually tasted really good. Now we're going to go on a few rides. We're going to aim for Small World, which is five minutes according to the app, uh, Phantom Manor, Pirates, uh, Bars. Oh, the ride times are really low at the moment, so I think everyone's left because, not everyone, but a lot of people are left because of the rain. But here we go with the rides.
Might be one of our favourites. <laughs> Just looking around the shop after pirates. This shop is quite nice. <laughs> yeah, little bags, little t shirt. These are the pins I've got in here 2024 ones, badges, pirates. You can't really see, but. Is that, there's not a single soul around. It's so quiet. I don't to see there. Oh, there's two people there, but it's so dead. It's not even raining right now. But we are heading over to um, Phantom Manor for maybe a couple of goes on that. not even that busy for the fireworks there is still well there's 20 minutes to go it's not busy at all but that's probably because it's raining back in the room that is it for today's vlog stay tuned for tomorrow's one and thank you so much for watching please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and don't forget to hit the subscribe button you can also head over to my instagram travel life with lucy for more content and i'll see you soon in the next one bye <laughs>